dropped frames. What does that mean? Well, I guess it's self-evident, isn't it? Aiden Starfang is playing Skyrim. No, I'm not. I'm playing Fallout New Vegas. I had a... I guess it says that from my, uh... Xbox setting because I'm a... You son of a bitch. See, I'm not even like two minutes into the stream. I'm already cursing and... Getting angry and... Okay. Okay, that looks a lot better. That looks a lot better. Look how fluid this is. Look at my character. Look how fluid that is. Who's, who's shooting at us? Geckos? That's so fucking clueless. Mr. Sandman, bring me a sim. Make him as delightful as. This is a really shitty weapon to be using. You know what? Why? Why? Why taunt fate? Let's let's just go around. Those golden geckos do not fuck around. Let's just you know what? Let's beat up let's beat up on him. <laughs> See how fluid that is now? Because of this PC. What a shame. I mean sure the graphics still look like ass, but look how fluid everything is now. <laughs> you know like oh my god, it's all like one FPS. I decided that ENB was not worth, like, like, I'm gonna do my research, okay? I'm gonna do my homework and try to find some, es like break time's over. some aesthetically pleasing low impact mods. Oh my god! Those guys literally came out of nowhere. Oh, well, yeah. Six, ten. That's why. Do you have any good weapons? See, I'm not used to playing... How come leather armor is... Okay, I thought metal armor was better. Come here, bitch. Come on. Oh, you got Mentats. Uh... You know, for for people who are using Mentats, they don't act very smart. Because Mentats are supposed to make you, like... I don't know why. That is just so satisfying when you, like, fix your own machines. That is just so satisfying hearing that. It's like, I did that. That was me. Yeah, I'm trying to check the goo pile. Thank you. Here I am coming in here with a fucking, like, that Benny suit, it's not armor. It has no armor. And I'm playing on, like, average, like, normal difficulty. I'm not playing on easy mode. Because that's, that's what I had agreed. That's what I agreed before, right? Anyway, as I was saying before, I so rudely interrupted... That I was going to do my research and find some low-impact mods. 
to make the game look pretty. And, uh... I honestly think... I don't know if I'm using clarity, but there must... I must be, because there's no orange tint, right? And there's supposed to be, like, an orange tint, like how in the Capital Wasteland, it's a green tint. I think that tint is there for reason, to make it look, like, good. You know, because without the tint, it looks worse. It's more obvious. And I was like, oh, I got EMB, yay! And then... Performance hits, and... I just want to be able to play the game on PC with all these wonderful mods and not... See, and then I don't have to play on on uh, Xbox. Because I don't know if I finished the 10th birthday playthrough. I think I did finish it because I did do the Caesars... Well, not Caesars, but I finished it for, like, uh, Yes Man, I think. And then I went back and I did started uh, Zion Canyon. I'll have to go through and check and see. But I'm at least going to beat the main game. Because I tried filming, like, two or three episodes of the DLC, the first, the... Well, the second, the Honest Hearts, and it kept crashing and shit. I'm just like, you know what? This is not worth it. Weapons. What do I have the most of? One seventy-seven. 177, 194. Looks like we have enough for this 9mm. And that'll do more damage than a freaking police baton. None of these settings, like, took, did they? Yeah, like, come on. We, 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 we have the graphics. We can handle this now. This is like me playing Morrowind on a Windows 10 Looks PC. Like we, can, we can handle it. I could have sworn this game had like a sprint button, but I guess it doesn't. Because you hit this, and okay. then you sneak. You hit that. Do my best. The other thumbstick, it does nothing. You hit this button, that's VATS. You hit this button, it's for third-person mode. Maybe I'm just getting confused with Skyrim. I guess that's what I'm doing. There's a lot of enemies over there. Are those going to be Vipers? Let's find out. Those are geckos. I don't want to mess with them. What level am I? Thirteen. One of my ESO characters is level thirteen, consequently. Where I think he just I think he's just past that. Just barely. I'm at the point where I'm leaving Canarthi's Roost, but... See, look at these graphics for the cars, the textures. They look like shit. Like, it just looks like dog shit. And I'm afraid to put too many, like, graphical mods, because I feel like that's going to upset the balance. If that makes sense. Like, I finally have it, the game, looking... Like, again. Again, look at this. Wanna be your dancer, girl? Look at those HD graphics, baby. I could be your dancer, girl, yeah. Remember that? Like, two years ago? And it was like, I was, like, moving in, like, one frame at a time. Slow motion. Not the case anymore. Yeah, that's not the case anymore. Who is that? Fucking ghoul. But, uh, yeah, the problem... Everyone, Cool, now pick out a good E&B. Yeah, I tried Rudy, 
because that's when Alchest Breach, I think, used or uses, and it looks really good. Let's go in here. The problem with that is it was basically back to playing like shit, and it was not worth... I, I decided unilaterally, because, you know, honestly, who else is going to decide? It wasn't worth the, the hit in performance, so... Tower on the strip, the one you can see for miles. I hear it ain't so. Oh my god. Oh my god. They scared the shit out of me. They sh they scared the shit out of me. Just come running out like Like, that shit's normal. You guys don't have anything, do you? Do you guys live here? I thought this was an enemy cave. We've been found! We've been had! Let's get out of here! So look at the look at how weird they're acting. Why are you acting that way? There's more to the cave, I think. Yeah, they're not acting suspicious. I mean, they're not aggressive. They're not hostile, so that's good, but they're Go ahead and take all this. Dirty water, you can keep that. Little kids shouldn't have dynamite. My name's Dynamite. I'm a drag queen. I sound like chills and poly sure. But I look like Bumini Babes. My name's Bumini Babes. Veronica who? Sorry, I didn't know her babes. Well, that's for me, babes. Oh, I'm vegan. Okay. Look at the low times, my lord. The low times are, like, insanely fast. Everything kind of looks like Crayola, like, plasticky. And I'm not feeling that. But I'm just happy that the game doesn't look like complete shit. Or play like complete shit. Which... Is like the important part, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's a radioactive crater, isn't it? In it. Jesus Christ. Keep out. Well, clearly it means I can go in, right? Hey there. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. I'm currently using Bloom and not HDR. Does that make a difference? Should I try it with HDR next and see if there's a difference? Because this is exactly how it looked last time without the ENB. And it didn't have Bloom selected. I think it had HDR by default. Because it, like, did the initial setup and said, Oh, we've detected your ultra quality or whatever. Well, Skyrim, it said ultra quality, which is like a first ever. I'm going to cheat just a little bit. Here we go. Huh. Oh. Oh. 
There we go. <laughs> True to Kaisar. You see how what I'm talking about when I say their faces and everything looks kind of roughshod, like it looks plasticky. I need to like screenshot this. Halt! What business have you in Cottonwood Cove, outsider? Oh, you just now figured that out, huh? You were the mark of Kaisar. You must be who Cursor Lucullus is waiting for. You may continue, but be... Get the oh. fuck out of my face. We're being held here against our will. I beg you, help us. Sorry, I'm just glad some... Please, sir, take pity. No way. If you want to help, get that. When will we be free? My family was ambushed by a pack of Legion raiders near Searchlight, and Frank ran off, the gutless coward. I have no idea where he is, but at least we're free from his abuse. Ever since he lost his job a few years back, he hasn't been the same. He took a switch to us for the tiniest things. We were trying to get away when the Legion showed up. I'm glad he ran off like a coward. But slavery wasn't the kind of escape I was looking for. Thank you. Thank you so much. Are you going to free us or what? <coughs> Bye. <coughs> Hey. Oh, it's just awful here. Can't you help us? Hurry up. Why don't none of them have any unique dialogue? I see you bear the mark of Caesar, Cursor Lucullus. Answer my questions, like bitch. To be kept waiting. I would find he should. St God damn it! Did you know the strips all stirred up lately? Who said that? That lady. I just. I'm not a fan of these graphics at all. They look like garbage. Cruising in the restroom. That's how George Michael got arrested, honey. Arcade, I hope that's not what you're doing tonight. Cruising in the restroom. Oh, oh, oh. Cruising in the restroom. Look at that. That was like a half second load time. I can't comprehend that. Our way. True to Kaisar. Your face looks like plastic. I'll wait. Are you ready to head up river? <sighs> yeah. You'll be meeting face to face with the mighty Kaisar himself, founder of the Legion, conqueror of 86 tribes. Oh, shit, let me go to get my a knowledge, soda. this is the first time Kaisar has ever summoned I need a drink to, to handle this. To see him. Not even tribal chieftains received this honor. Mm-hmm. All who are not legion are dissolute. They live in squalor, unrestrained by morality, lacking moderation, temper, and self-control. Their very existence is a blight on the common good. Even worse are the profligates, the subtype of dissolute one finds this side of the river. They hold themselves to be civilized, when in fact they are corrupt and self-interested. The truth will be made clear to them soon enough. So I know I said I was going to get a soda, but I saw some cheese in the fridge, and being the white person that I am, I can't turn down some cheese. You'd know better than I would, but you must be remarkable for Kaisar to take such an interest. Get me out of here. The trip will take a few hours. Take your place on the boat. 
That's worse than the boat that Surge was s traveling What's around up? in. By order of Kaisar, all visitors must disarm and relinquish all banned items. This order also extends to the platinum chip you carry. For now. Alcohol and all chems, including stims and other addictive items. I know not why Kaisar would wish to speak with such a physically inferior whelp. But I will allow this one exception. You may bear Kaisar's mark, but do not attempt to share any of your medicine with anyone in the fort. Hey, why would I do that? Your belongings will be returned to you when you leave. You know how much money it costs? Wait, wait, wait a second. What's going on? Am I playing Virgil to your To get all this dope? I'd like to assume that we're tiptoeing into the mouth of hell out okay. of academic curiosity. Okay, his lips aren't moving. But I'm not so open-minded that I've lost my brains. Short of canceling our imminent travel plans, that's the best thing you could have said. Just be careful. If we travel at Caesar's pleasure, he may not let us out as easily. What's up? Okay. Lead the way. Do other people? I'm looking forward to getting sent. You may proceed. The river. His lips the are moving. Return when you leave. What the hell? Also, I heard that Niner mod got updated recently. Like, last year or the year before. That is, like, something else. That is, like... My chair doesn't want to swing back now. Oh, shit. Oh, here we go. There. <laughs> Well, hey, Dale Barton. So you're the visitor I've heard some of the legionaries talking about. If you're in the mood to trade, just say the word. I haven't had the pleasure. I have crossed paths with Legate Lanius, his second in command, however. It was unpleasant. He's the best the legion has to offer, or so the legionaries say. Brute of a man, wears a fancy metal mask in a battle. He killed one of my pack Brahmins simply because it was in his way. I knew better than to complain about it, though. Be seeing you around. Some yeah, they get mad when you kill their stories about the burned man again. When you kill their slaves. They get mad. I've heard rumors that one of the tribes west of the river may join the Legion. You know, all the slaves seem to be women. What? I'm harsh on the children, but they'll be excellent Legionaries. I'm quite proud of them. What's up? What's wrong with your face? See you around. There's something wrong with his face. Evening. Okay.
Kaisar awaits you. We can talk afterwards. Hi, honey. Some of the slaves have been spreading stories about the burned man again. <laughs> oh! So I finally get to meet the courier who's accomplished so much in so little time. That's why I summoned you here, right? I mean, a man nearly kills you, and your response is to track him across the breadth of the Mojave? You arrive on the strip and waltz into the Lucky 38 like someone left you a key under the doormat? You assassinate the head of the chairman in his own casino and get away with it? Then something happens to Mr. House's robot, some kind of military upgrade? Yeah. When you set your mind to something, you get results. I like that. The question is... Are you ready to get started? Oh, I'll give you the platinum chip, and then you'll use it exactly like I tell you to. The time is fast approaching when my legion will assault the Great Dam and invade the West. Before that happens, I want Mr. House knocked out of the game. A quick one-two punch, with you doing the punching. Down the hill, at the west edge of camp, is an old building. It was here when the fort was taken in 2277. Inside the building is a hatch. And inside that hatch are two steel doors that bear the sigil of the Lucky 38 Casino. Now that same sigil is on the platinum chip you were carrying. Isn't that interesting? Even more interesting, there's a slot about the same size as the chip on the console that opens the hatch. So you know what I think? I think the platinum chip opens those doors. Doors that can't be pried open, or drilled open, or blasted open. Because all that, I tried. I want you to destroy whatever you find in there. And then I want you to come back here and tell me about it. So go to the building and take this fucking platinum chip with you. My legionaries will meet you there. With your weapons and equipment. Goodbye. Don't shoot him in the face. Don't shoot him in the face. Don't shoot him in the face. What a load of Brahmin shit. Can you believe that guy? Hey, your face is fixed. Well, yeah. Right. What did I expect? The man's a megalomaniac. He acts like this is some preordained cycle we're returning to. Of all the people who could learn from our past mistakes, he goes and throws all of our knowledge off a cliff. Instead of trying to learn from the past, he recreates it, runs back over the same old barren ground. Yeah. The camps are getting crowded. I'm just going to have them wait there. I'm sure it'll be fine. Maybe I need to turn the brightness up. The new slave girls are quite beautiful. That is so problematic. Kaisar has permitted your weapons. Kaisar has put a Shut up, asshole. I see you reached your destination safely. Shall we get to work? Was that meant to be a shocking revelation? Of course Caesar wants it destroyed. He's afraid of what the bunker might hold, and rightly so. But you're not going to do that. You're going to do the smart thing, and work for me. I don't respond well to threats. Now where were we? 
As you know, the Platinum Chip upgrades my Securitron's operating software. Well, there's an army of them here. Maybe I should The Securitron's policing this strip are a fraction of the total number manufactured. The rest I stored here. I need you to manually upload the data from the chip to the facility's primary computer. There's a terminal at the other end of this facility. There's a complication. While I can broadcast to this screen, I can't control any of the facility's systems. That means I can't deactivate its security bots, most of which appear to be active according to the status board I'm looking at. Good. I won't hold you up any longer. Why does that count as stealing? Continued resistance is our law. Oh my god. I never noticed that, like, trippy sci-fi music in the background before. Was that from like the original Fallout 1? Hmm. Excuse me? Motherfucker. I'm doing an out chest breach does. I'm sneezing. Did you guys believe that a bunker like this really actually exists in Nevada? Wait, are they hostile? Huh. Your work here is done. 
Return to the Lucky 38 so we can discuss next steps. You have a very bright future ahead of you. Thanks to your actions today, so does the rest of mankind. Junk. You've carried out Kaisar's will. Okay, asshole. You're free. Holy shit, is it dark. Dark, 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 dark. Oh, that's right, duh. <laughs> the camps are getting crowded. Well, maybe if you quit kidnapping people. I felt the ground shake a while ago. I'll take that as a sign you've got the job done. Let's press on, shall we? As I was telling you before, I want Mr. House out of the picture. You have an interest in his death, too. If he knows that you destroyed his gadgets beneath the fort, he will strike back. You know where to find him. How he dies, I leave up to you. Good. Don't know what kind of security he has inside the Lucky 38, but if you can find a way of catching him off guard, do so. I suspect you'll be a valuable asset to the Legion, assuming you're really on our side, of course. To call a news ferocious would be an understatement. In battle, he seizes the enemy in his jaws and will not let go. He thinks nothing of suffering losses, so long as the enemy suffers more. Though unsubtle, he is not dim. He detects traps, and sets his own. Be glad you will not have to face his judgment. If you are true to Kaisar. Ole. Ole! Until Mr. House has been dealt with, you and I have nothing to talk about. Awe, true to Kaisar. I'll just be borrowing that. Lead the way. Okay. I'm looking forward to getting sent across the river. <laughs> Isn't that like an insult? Or a threat they would say to people? I'm gonna send Boy, I'm gonna send your ass across the river. If you do, if you keep acting up. <clears throat> Well, you keep acting, I'll send your ass across the river. Yeah, it wouldn't be good if it crashed. Looking forward to getting sent across the river. Can you imagine just sleeping out here? In these little sleeping bags. Are these sleeping bags? Or the bedroll? They're not even sleeping bags, they're just bed rolls. There's no blankets, no pillows. I bet the kids, those kids that are training are forced to sleep there. To toughen them up or something. It makes sense. Not that I agree with it, but... 
So how's everyone? All my uh, two subscribers, how are you enjoying the stream now that I, uh... You're not who I need to talk to. Now that I have better graphics. A better computer. You may proceed. Your belongings Asshole. Will... Awe, are you ready to return to Cottonwood Cove? Candle Cove, yes! Very well. Be I love that show with the Muppets, the talking... Uh, skeleton guy and the girl and the pirate and all that. I love it. It's a great show. It never existed. But it's a great show. Fuck. I forgot I'm only level 13. See, I'm used to, like, uh... Like, really, really, really... Over-leveling my characters. So, like, because I've been playing... ESO... And then The Sims doesn't really have leveling, but it has, like, learning, and you have, like, little act skills that you learn and stuff. But, like, I'm used to, like, pretty much being post-game. Well, not post-game, but having, like, end-game level stats. Of course, you know, they're little heads on pikes. I gotta figure out how to make these textures look better. So it looks like dog shit. The game plays spectacularly, but it looks like dog shit. Please help me. Legion caught me. Said this was the penalty for drug runners. Please let me down. Please, for the love of God, let me down. Can't even be bothered to ask the question, huh? <sighs> Thanks for getting me down from that cross. I owe you one. Well, not exactly. More like trying to expand our markets. I heard there was a lot of untapped territory down south. But the Legion caught me. A legion patrol caught me trying to cross the river. When they found the, um, package I was carrying, they strung me up there. So long. Oh, so I don't even get good karma for that. Figures. Well, let's go tell Mr. House. It's so, like, yeah, I sent you to kill him. Like, a while ago. And it kind of, it seemed, you know, I, I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to, like, assume things. Because you know what they say about assuming. You know, but it kind of, it kind of seems like you're still doing stuff for him, you know, like, stuff is happening for him. That is really dark in here. Can I sit on this furniture? Okay, good. I just remember there being part of, like, Lucky 38 where you can't sit on the furniture, and I thought that was a real waste. I bugged your casino. Look at that. I, th I thought this was a carpet. It's marble. Wow. It actually looks gorgeous. Gorgeous marble. Where to, partner? Let's go to the cocktail lounge. Oh, God. Look at this. This just looks... Not good. Ugh. Yeah.
Suddenly I feel all tingly, and I find I've got a rocket launcher. And I have male genitalia. You do? Why, that's just wonderful. <clears throat> I'll take it and put it with the rest of the collection. I'm just kidding. It's a robot. They don't have any. You look different. How sweet of you to notice, sugar. I've been upgraded to the Mark II software, and it's peachy having these high explosive weapons fully accessible. Good to see you. It is. It is good to see me. The foundation is laid. My Securitrons on the Strip are upgraded, and those at the fort ready for action. Now it's just a matter of adjusting the attitudes of some lesser groups while we wait for Caesar's Legion to attack Hoover Dam. What did you want to discuss? Yes, I know. It was detected immediately and deactivated, let's see, 39.735 seconds after you planted it. You thought I wouldn't notice. What else did you want to discuss? That's because he ceased to be relevant when you recovered the platinum chip. Revenge doesn't interest me. Progress does. Sorry to deny you a moment of primate triumph, but you'll have to go elsewhere to sound your barbaric yawp. What else did you want to discuss? <clears throat> One of the followers of the apocalypse, I'm sure. They're curious about me. Good luck planting a surveillance device here in the Lucky 38 without my knowing about it. What else did you want to discuss? I've resurrected Vegas, spirit intact. What I need now is the ability to enforce my rightful claim. Not just against Caesar's Legion, by the way. In fact, the NCR is a more present and insidious threat. To enforce, one must have force, a position of strength. Years ago, when I detected NCR scouts roaming the Mojave, I could tell from their uniforms that these were no mere tribesmen. I knew it was only a matter of time before an army appeared to take control of the dam. And I knew my Securitrons wouldn't be enough to oppose them. And so I recruited the three families. Vegas belongs to me because I mustered enough strength to bring the NCR to the bargaining table. Indeed it was, and <clears throat> still is, but not without taking significant casualties. Would Kimball and Oliver have traded the lives of hundreds of soldiers for absolute control of Hoover Dam? Oh, yes. They weren't afraid of me. They were afraid of Caesar, that attacking me would leave them vulnerable to a Legion offensive. And so they negotiated, not out of the kindness of their hearts, as they try to make it seem, because the calculus of power left no other choice. NCR forces were permitted to occupy Hoover Dam and establish a military base at McCarran Airport. Well, it used to be one. They recognized my sovereignty over the Vegas Strip and agreed to supply electricity and water once their engineers repaired the dam. Written into the treaty were provisions that the NCR do nothing to prevent its soldiers and civilians from visiting the Strip. That's how I harnessed the NCR to my endeavor. Their occupation has been the engine of my growing economy. The salient issue is that they will go to war with me, if given the chance. There's just one reason why the NCR hasn't contrived some outrage to justify invading the Strip. Caesar's Legion. The final battle between those two armies is fast approaching. I can't afford to let either side win on their terms. What else? Caesar's did you want Pizza. To Little Caesar's Pizza. You know it'd be cool if there was a third final battle option where you have to invade the strip and like fight your way to fight Mr. House. That'd be kinda cool. New Vegas is more than a city. It's the remedy to mankind's 
derailment. The city's economy is a blast furnace in which can be forged the steel of a new rail line running straight to a new horizon. What is the NCR? A society of people desperate to experience comfort, ease, luxury. A society of customers. With all that money pouring in, give me 20 years and I'll reignite the high technology development sectors. 50 years and I'll have people in orbit. 100 years and my colony ships will be heading for the stars to search for planets unpolluted by the wrath <laughs> and folly of a bygone generation. Boomers. I prefer the term autocrat. I would rule as a chief executive. I would not answer to a board of directors or any other entity. Nothing to impede progress. If you want to see the fate of democracies, look out the windows. My judgment. I have no interest in abusing others, just as I have no interest in legislating or otherwise dictating what people do in their private time. Nor have I any interest in being worshipped as some kind of machine god messiah. I am impervious to such corrupting ambitions. Ooh. But autocracy? Yes, Firm head. control in the hands of a technological and economic visionary? Yes, that Vegas shall have. He has a big what head. What else did you want to discuss? What of it? I enjoy them. There's something about a little diorama set inside a glass dome that I find pleasing. If you run across any out in the wastes, turn them in to Jane. She'll compensate you. What else did you want to discuss? Goodbye. Wait, wait, wait. The next step is to add the boomer's considerable firepower to my growing... Use extreme caution when approaching the base. Their firepower is considerable. Recently, one of my roaming Securitrons observed a man near the base studying the pattern of its artillery fire. Maybe he's learned something. Ugh. Look at these textures. Look at how ugly this is. I have it on Bloom right now, and it's not much different from <laughs> HDR, I'd assume. I just want it to look like normal in-game textures. Lead the way. And not this weird... raw, woodeny, plasticky crap. So I'm gonna quit here for now and Hey, if you've been able to bug Mr. House's network yet. God damn it, Emily, yes. Good to hear. But it looks like the bug was deactivated a few minutes after it went online. It looks like House has some kind of countermeasure in place to prevent eavesdropping on his network. Well duh. We'll get through eventually, just not today. Here are those medical supplies I Thanks. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Is there anything that's... I can bring that up to ten, that's fine. <coughs> As I was saying, Emily, I'm going to quit here for now and I'm going to look some graphics and stuff that make this look less like shit. 
and uh, I'll pick up later.